well. I mean, Arabic is one of the most important languages, world languages, uh, and it's still in widespread use and growing use today. So Arabic is actually growing. The demand and the interest in Arabic is actually um, increasing. It's also one of the six United Nations languages. Um, and the British Council also brought out a publication this year and um, mentioned our class Arabic as being the second most important language for the UK. Uh, in terms of language, uh, here at Manchester we teach two levels of Arabic. We teach classical Arabic, which is the language of the Quran and classical sources, but we uh, also teach on mainly focus on standard Arabic. And mahallat wal aswaq. We um, teach uh, Arabic in small groups, Arabic language in small groups, and uh, it is very intensive in the first year uh, as we take students from scratch. Uh, so we teach them from the alphabet all the way to become fluent at the end of the course. There's a mixture of classes, so one day you could be reading a paragraph from a book out loud in order to improve pronunciation, or another day doing a group exercise, sort of um, written comprehension or reading comprehension or speaking practice, so talking to each other about what you did last week. We have a huge uh, resource centre at the library, uh, the main Manchester University Library, um, and uh, we have a very large stock of um, written material, uh, literature, films. Every student who is studying a language have to go and spend uh, some time abroad. In fact, this uh, gives students a lot of confidence because what's, uh, you know, the, the things that they've learned in the book, they, they will now put into practice in a totally uh, Arab environment where they will have to speak uh, to get along. I chose Jordan because I'd heard quite good things about it. The option there was to either study at the university or at the Language Academy. I chose the Language Academy. So whilst there, I think I did about 20 hours or 25 hours a week of Arabic. For my year abroad, I went to Jordan and I studied at um, a private language school in the capital in Amman and had an absolutely amazing time. It was the best year of my life. But overall, I think it's quite a good package, a language degree because you don't just study a language, you study all of the things that come with it as well, the history, the culture, the literature, and that sets you up for the future. I definitely would recommend studying Arabic at Manchester. I've had a really enjoyable four years here, and I think just how underrepresented Arabic is, in spite of how huge, like how widely it's spoken and how important it is as a language will make it an important, a really important skill to have.